Hi, I'm Leslie McVeigh. Welcome to CTN Member Highlights. Today I'm at the Wainwright Recreation Center in South Portland with some of the members of the group Speaking Up for Us. I'm with Lori Bernier from Speak Up with Us. Hi, Lori. Hi. Hi. So, why are we here today? Well, um, this is a Speaking Up for Us sports chapter, and it's all about the members making choices, what they want to do, and they decided they wanted to go biking. And so we did this last year, people enjoyed it, and so we're doing it again today. I'm now with Tyler Ingalls. Hi, Tyler. Hi. You're awfully tall, and yes. I don't think you're really that tall. Right. If the camera That's can really look, interest. they can see down. You've got these big skates on. Right. <laughs> now, you're involved with the Portland chapter, yes. and you and, and, and Lori right. run it together? Right. Or? Yeah. And I wrote uh, like a two or three essays to help start the group up, and it was something I wanted to do when I got part of Derby because it's like, I didn't see a lot of disabled people into community sports or in the community, so it's something I wanted to kind of, oh. and also activities too. I just want people to get people more active. Speaking Up for Us has chapters all over the state for adults that have developmental disabilities um, who want to make changes, who want to improve their lives, and so this gives them a forum to get together and discuss issues and figure out ways to improve their life. So do they lobby in, in Augusta or well, Washington? They, we help them to do whatever they feel they need to do. And so yes, we have had big issues that we're, like right now we're tackling transportation, it's, which is a huge issue for people. And we're also delving into jobs. That's a huge issue for people. People want to work, and there's, there are just so many barriers. So we, uh, whatever members want to work on is um, what they work on together with, with all of us. Our Bangor chapter is a, is a vibrant chapter now, and, and, one, and it's um, the advisor, her name is Krista, and she does a great job, and, um, and she's really, really working, working with us to, uh, to, to make, choi make positive choices. And the sports chapter is just yes. one of many um, various groups yes. under the umbrella of the yes. Speaking Up yes. for Us. So tell me about some of the others. Yeah, so I should say, so, so most of the chapters are kind of advocacy oriented. Um, and then we have the sports chapter, which is to help people be more, um, participate more in their own communities, doing whatever. People want to just get out and do any sport they want to. They don't want to be limited to the softball throw, um, et cetera. Um, and, and then we also have an art department chapter. We will probably be starting a technology chapter soon. Um, yeah, wow. so those are the two that are upcoming. That sounds wonderful. One of the other, one of the other things the uh, Bangor chapter is doing for the first time is uh, things like fundraising. We're actually, uh, we're actually out raising money to, so that all of our members that want to go to the statewide conference can go. And so it's you know it's been great, and also and also we've uh, rec we've increased our membership at the Bangor chapter too, which is something that had never happened before. Do the members get together weekly? Or? Well, we actually get together bi-weekly, and because we're all over the state for the sport chapter, we actually go online and call in and all discuss topics of interest. Um, problems we're having, um, ways we can be more involved in community sports and recreation together and then we get together mm, maybe every three months or so and do something fun together. And I love the idea that the sports because it's so important for all of us. 
to yeah. be able to be physical right. and flexible as long as we can. And the thing is the education goes both ways. So you learn some of the things about us and you learn some about us, but you also realize that we're not so different after a while. Right. That. And You're better athletes. <laughs> well, not, I would say that. But, I mean, but it's also like um, natural supports. Yeah. That so if somebody needs a job, we all connect more naturally than yeah. than yeah. with artificial supports. Yeah. I'm with Abbott now. Hi, Abbott. Hi. Now you're part of the Portland branch, right? Uh, I'm part of the art department branch, right. which was in Port, which is in Portland. Right, and we've hit, we've worked with the art department yep. before, as you said. I've interviewed you before. Yes. <laughs> now this is not your first bike ride no i've yeah. i've biked uh for a while mm -hmm. for a number of years yes or? number so, of years so do you bike in between the the gatherings or yes oh so you're you're a real biker yeah yeah and when did you start biking when you were a kid or uh after i graduated from high school mm -hmm. and then just picked it right up yeah yeah there's a sense of freedom with it isn't there yes there is yeah. well tell me a little bit about the bike ride this is your second yeah. time yes. you're you're not a newbie right. you've done this before huh? yes now are you, why did you want to do it again was it really exciting the yes first it was time? yes it was it was it was very exciting the first time and you know and I enjoy doing it now I'm with our third biker Chris hi Chris hi are you from the Portland area chapter no, I'm down. I'm from the Sanford chapter. Oh, so you drove up here today? Yes, I drove all the way from Sanford all the way up to Portland. <laughs> and you're the person who hasn't done this before. Yeah, I've never done this before. <laughs> what made you want to do it today? Um, I've always wanted to try something like this, and it's like a great opportunity. Good for you. For me to give it a. We give it a chance. Uh -huh. Now, but you've ridden a bike like this before, or not even? Not done even. That? I've never rode in a bike ever in oh. my life. Oh, oh! So Are you kidding? You were doing great. I was watching you ride around the parking lot. Yeah. yeah. So. <laughs> wow, this is a big day for you then. Yeah. How does it feel? I like it. Yeah. Do you think you might keep doing it after this? Yes. Yeah. Great. Well, I hope you have a great ride. Thank you.